What's up guys, Toasty here, back with another Apex Legends video, hope you all are having a fantastic day. And today we're going to be talking about the new Season 2 info, about the new daily and weekly challenges in the season and how they're going to work out. This information was released on Reddit by the lead product manager Dr. Lee Horn. It starts off by telling us that these challenges will allow you to make significantly greater battle pass progress meaning you'll unlock that sweet sweet loot with less grind over less time by returning on a regular basis to complete challenges. It also follows on by saying that these uh, challenges are easy to do and they do not take they do not require a YouTube tutorial to figure out, meaning you can do it by yourselves as well. Then the structure of the challenges is explained by telling us that 6 of the 10 weekly challenges will grant an entire battle pass level as a reward. The remaining daily and weekly challenges grant stars which combined with match XP contribute to a repeatable weekly challenge that grants a full battle pass level with each completion. Stars are XP specific to battle pass, meaning stars do not impact account level progression. The daily challenges structure is basically that there are going to be three daily challenges randomly chosen from a pool of over 200 and they are going to be simple and can be obtained from a short play session and it is said that it resets every day so completing each one every day is going to be uh, good for uh, completing the battle pass progress. Then the weekly challenges are explained and it said that each week 7 new weekly challenges are given to us. These challenges are intended to take several play sessions to complete and range from get 20 kills as Gibraltar, Bangalore or Mirage to loot 100 epic items. 4 of the weekly challenges are worth 6000 stars and three of the weekly challenges grant an entire battle pass level each upon completion. And if you start the season late, and if you buy the battle pass late, uh, for example, you buy the battle pass of week two, you're gonna get the first week challenges as well, so you can complete them. Then they also added a new a new setting that there is going to be special three weekly challenges that are going to be the same in every week, and they can give you repeatedly battle pass progress. They, you complete them, and you're they, you're gonna get again the battle pass progress again and again over the time. It is said that to earn a battle pass level through stars, you have to earn 9000 stars and or match XP. And then this quest may be repeated an unlimited number of times each week. Each completion increases the stars and or match XP required for the next by 9000 up to a maximum of 54000. You need 9000 for the first level, 18000 for the second level, etc. This challenge resets to 9000 each week, meaning each week you can progress to 54000 and then you need to go back to 9000 at the first week and then you can repeat it up. In my opinion this is a great addition and the structure is well developed because it balances the gameplay and the objectives and the progression of the battle pass so it provides ease to the casual players and the, to the hardcore players of the game as well. Comment down below what you guys think, make sure to like and subscribe and ring the post notification bell on for whenever I upload. This is Toasty, signing out.